weight room training has begun for some of the youngest Eagles football players here at Dakota Ridge High. Head up, get down, there you go, come on. And I'm gonna get you on the next one, ready, go. As usual, head football coach Ron Wadalevich, Coach Woj for short, is giving his athletes encouragement and support. He still carries the frame of his football playing former self. This year marks his 34th year as coach. He's 23rd at Dakota Ridge. In fact, he was here when the school first opened. During all that time, he's racked up an impressive 100 plus wins and multiple playoff appearances. All the accolades that Coach Woj has had, local, regional, national, as a coach, you know, he will never point to those or the wins as his barometer for success. For, for Coach Woj, it's so much more than, than the X's and O's. He will tell you, you want to know if I'm a success? Look at the kids that have come through this program. Uh, are they good husbands, good fathers, and good people in the community? That's how I know if I'm a good coach or not, and, and he, he lives it. His community work is widely known, including his yearly support of the Step Up Walk for Down Syndrome in honor of Dakota Ridge assistant football coach, Mark Leon. His players always take part. You know, we got kids that are playing for us now that didn't realize Mark was a student here at one time. You know, he's always been Coach Mark, and they, they come out on a Sunday morning at, at City Park at 8 o'clock in the morning, and they walk and throw the football and have fun with him. But it's always important to be there and to support Mark, and, and, and that means a lot to us. Yeah, it's really a cool experience to see those kids get to go through that and how much they respect Mark. Last season, Coach Woj's world and that of the entire Dakota Ridge community was shattered when Eagles player Christian Fredrickson was diagnosed with cancer. The coach was one of the first people he told. Stood up, I gave him a hug, said, I'm sorry. He said, don't be sorry, coach, because I'm going to kick cancer's ass. And that, that's how he fought it from the get-go. And he would text me at night when he was getting chemo. And so we talked back and forth. This kid. He went down fighting. I mean, he had such an infectious smile. The day that Christian passed, he set some up at the school, like, wanted us just to be together. You know, like, a lot of us are kind of lost, and it didn't, you know, it just didn't feel fair. This whole season, we've dedicated to Christian, and we just want to give our all on the field because we know if, you know, if he was still here, he'd want to give his all on the field, too. That was Christian. He didn't flinch in, in the face of adversity here, no matter how hard or how tired or how sore you think you're in that game, you know, think about what Christian went through. At Dakota Ridge, Coach Woj is seen as someone who exemplifies the school's founding principles, living, loving, learning, leaving a legacy. If you can find any one of those in an excellent staff member here, but to find all four in one is a unique thing. And Woj continually brings that, and most definitely with his, with his student athletes. He's not only focused on making us better athletes, but just better men for the future after high school, and making sure that we're ready for the future. Even out off the field, he's always been there, just checking up on us, texting us, calling us. It's not all just football. He wants all of us to stay together and support one another. A testimony of that is Woj has been to so many different weddings and been notified of children being born and everything like that because he's made such an impact on kids their lives. Yeah, Coach, you're a hero to us and we couldn't thank you more for everything you've done for us. Explode up. Explode. Explode. That's all you. Here you go. Okay. 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 